So now let's see how we can work around with the text tool inside of Tinkercad. So in order to work around with the text tool, you can see that on the basic shape option, you can see that there's, um, an, um, there's an option called text. If I were to click on text, then I can keep the text anywhere as I want. And there you go, you got the text. You can also bring in individual letters by changing from basic shapes to uh, going on to text and numbers. Once you go there, you can see that there's different uh, sort of uh, letters that you can simply click and drag in as well. You can go around and there's numbers, there's symbols, all kind of things that you can bring in. But these are just the shapes right here, where, which you can resize and then work around with. So I'm just going to delete these and I'm going to go back to this text that we have right here. And even on text and number, the first option is the text itself. So if I were to go over here, here's the text. I can type in whatever I want. So in my case, I'm just going to type in tutor tube right here with capital T's and this is what you have. You can go around and choose the color of the text just like this and the color is applied as well. You can go around and here you can see that there's the type of font that you can choose. So there's the sans font, there's the sans mono font, there's the serif font and so forth. So you can go around and choose the type of font you want as well. So I'm just going to go around and choose sans right here. You can increase the height of the font right here and you can also increase the bevel. So let's say for example, if I were to increase the bevel right here, that is what you have. And here are the segments. So if I were to increase the segment, then you can see that the edges is actually smoothed out. So you can go around and you can bring down the, the smoothness or bring up the smoothness of the edges by adding in segments as well. And this is how it, it actually works. You can see that the edges are smoothened out right over here and that is how you can change out the text and so showcase it in the way you want. So that is how you can work around with uh, the text tool inside of Tinkercad. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.